Welcome seventh graders to your digital fourth quarter art instruction. Art lessons will be posted each day with instructions and examples and sometimes video instructions as well. You can do most of the assignments at home with just computer paper, even notebook paper, pencils, crayons, markers, color pencils. The first project starting on Tuesday is going to be a still life made of six objects that you can find around your home, in your room, in your kitchen, um, and you're going to arrange those objects any way you'd like. You're going to take a picture of that and then you're going to do a drawing of it. Make sure you read the instructions on Google Classroom for the still life assignment. A few things to keep in mind about your still life. You want to use shading, uh, also known as value. So you need a wide range of lights and darks, very, very light to very dark and lots of grays in between. You also need to make sure you use up the entire paper. You can use pencil or color pencil for this artwork if you'd like. Just keep in mind, you should be spending about 45 minutes on this project each day. You can break it up into 15 minute segments if you'd like. Remember to take your time and also try your best. This still life assignment should be started no later than Tuesday, March 17th, and make sure you have it done by midnight of March 30th. If it's possible, have a parent stop in tomorrow to pick up supplies. You can pick up supplies from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. at RBC. I'll have drawing paper, tag board, and computer paper. The paper can be used for other upcoming projects too since we will not be returning to school until April 6th. I'm wishing you guys the best of luck on your still life assignment and please email me Whenever you have questions or ever need any help on anything, um, feel free to email me. There are some sample artworks attached to the lesson instructions. Thanks for watching 7th Grade Artists, and hopefully I'll see you guys really soon. Bye!